All right, rating music. Uh, probably one of the things that I try to um, argue the most is that you need to rate your music as you import it. It makes it much easier. Or at least you can rate your music as you play it. Now, you'll notice next to every song, you should have a column for rating. It might not be right next to the name of the song. You might find it down the row a little bit. If you want to reorder these columns, you can just click and drag them. So again, just click, hold, and drag it to where you want it to be. If you don't see the rating column there, right-click on the title bar there and make sure that rating has a checkbox next to it. I'll go back here. All right, so in this case, for example, this song has three out of five stars. This one has five stars, so forth and so on. You'll notice that the top one, named Apologize, has five stars, but they're not solid. They're outline stars. Uh, and this is because the album that this comes from, which is called Dreaming Out Loud, has five stars, but the song itself has not been rated. Now, if you want to change the rating of a song, you can simply just click next to it, increase the number of stars, or decrease the number of stars like this. Now, if you want zero stars, you actually have to click off of the stars completely. I'm going to go ahead and give that four stars again. Another way to rate a song, for example, is to right-click on it and select rating and pick either none or one to five stars. So if I change this to four stars, you'll notice that changes there. So it's pretty easy to rate your music. Um, another thing you want, might want to uh, consider is this little arrow here, which expands your playlist. Now currently, I'm in the summer music playlist, you'll notice down here. And I've expanded my, um, my playlist to include the artwork and the album. So now I know which album has which song in my playlist. And I can rate the album and the song separately. For example, Dreaming Out Loud, the album by One Republic, has five stars, as you can see here. The song has not been rated. Now, notice what happens if I change the rating of the album from three, five stars to three stars, now it changes here from five to three, but not solid stars, outline stars. Now watch what happens. I really like this song, so I can give it five stars, and yet the album remains with a three star rating. But now this song, let me click off of it, has five solid stars. So solid stars are for the rating of the song, and outline stars are for the rating of the album. Now I think this is a five star album, so I'm going to go ahead and give it five stars. Now if I, if I scroll down I'll notice that I have um, ratings for all the albums in this playlist and all my songs are also rated. Now rating songs makes it much easier to organize your music and make smart playlists based on ratings. So once again don't forget to rate your music as you import it or at least while you're playing it it's easy to do and in the long term it makes making playlists very very easy.